The Hawthorne effect states that people will act differently when aware they're being observed. Naturally then, monitoring will affect employees' behavior. But does it help or harm productivity? Researchers have been asking this question for over a hundred years. Some have argued that monitoring improves productivity. It can also encourage good behaviors and discourage bad ones. However, monitoring can also have a negative effect. Employees can fear being punished, experience narrow focus, or feel their autonomy is threatened. With these conflicting views, how can we effectively use monitoring in the workplace? When is it useful and when is it not? To answer this, we did a study in a clothing manufacturing plant in India. This factory produces trousers and jackets for men's suits. In 2012, they installed a system that monitored worker activity for selected manufacturing lines. Every time an employee started to work on a task, they would scan an RFID code. This allowed their progress to be tracked down the production line. We grouped the tasks the workers performed as either simple or complex. This we determined from the average time that workers take to complete a task. We also measured worker efficiency by comparing a worker's individual task completion times against the average for that task. Our results showed that people working on simple tasks had improved results when monitored. They made a game out of their tasks to ward off boredom, a process known as gamification. But those working on complex tasks showed decreased productivity. These workers felt that monitoring controlled them and interfered with their work. How much did productivity change? For simple tasks, it rose by 10%. But for complex tasks, it fell by 8.5%. In both cases, a significant result. Therefore, monitoring in the workplace is best applied to simple and gamified tasks, but best avoided for more complex tasks. Read the full paper to learn more.